How's it going everybody? Sean Pierce Johnson here with New Neighbor Audio Effects and today we're taking a look at the Seraphim Mono Shimmer. If you're looking for that Choir of Angels sound, the search is over. The Seraphim gives you that magical sound in an easy to use, easy to manipulate, and pedal board friendly enclosure. It's super simple to use, so let's take a closer look at it. There's three knobs on the face of the pedal. Mix, which is going to adjust your wet dry blend of the shimmer effect. Depth, which is just the overall decay time of the reverb. And then the shim knob sets the level of the shimmer effect. Now let's dial in some sounds. See what I did there? One of the cool things about the Seraphim is it acts as two pedals in one enclosure. It starts with the sound that we know and love from the wet reverb and then adds that cool choir of angels magical high octave overtone onto the decays of the reverb. It's really simple to do and can be done on the fly in bypass or active state. It's very simple. As you can see on the face of the pedal the LED is blinking right now. When the LED is blinking you're in shimmer mode. To get to reverb mode, just press and hold on the foot switch for less than a second and you're in no standard reverb mode. You'll know when you see that the LED has gone solid. And to turn the shimmer back on, press and hold, and when the LED starts blinking, there you go, you're in shimmer mode. Here's a nice sound that adds a subtle dimension to some strumming patterns. Here's my dry signal. This next sound is really nice to use when you're playing arpeggiated patterns. This next sound that I've dialed in, I've got a nice reverb that I'm going to use to play with some rhythm guitar. And then when I take a lead, I'm going to kick on the shimmer. Well, there you have it, your look at the Seraphim Mono Shimmer. For info on this pedal and the rest of the New Neighbor line, you can visit the website, newneighbor.net. Thanks for watching, everyone.
we'll see you next time.